I'm a lifelong Frederick resident. I grew up right by TJ High School, went through North Frederick and uh, TJ High School, went on to University of Maryland, came back to Frederick County, married my high school sweetheart, Cheryl. We've been married for 37 years now. We had three children here in Frederick and now five grandchildren. Both my wife and I have been small business owners. I'm a, a financial planner, investment manager is what I do for my professional uh, practice. Uh, but I've been very involved in the community and education's always been extremely important to me. I served 15 years on the board of Frederick Community College and 12 years on the board of Frederick County Public Schools. So education will always be my number one priority. I ran for the council because I love Frederick and want to continue to serve and so education will be a top priority. Uh, making sure that our seniors are taken care of, our environment, our parks, and our public safety are all going to be priorities of mine. I was involved in politics at a very young age. My dad was elected to the Board of Aldermen for Frederick when I was four and mayor when I was eight. And he was mayor all the way till I was 24, so politics were just something that were a part of our family. And so I was very active in knowing what was going on in our community and the, and the importance of being involved. However, my wife, when we got married, I decided that I wasn't going to be involved in politics because I wanted to be there for my kids. And uh, we've now raised our children. They've all grown up. They all uh, now have five grandchildren. And my wife said, hey, it's time that you can be involved in politics. So we talked about it and decided that the county council would be a good next step uh, to be able to stay involved with our community and give back, uh, but also still be in the community to be active with our, our children and our grandchildren. Well, my wife and I are big sports nuts. We've seen the Orioles play in 25 different stadiums. I've seen the Redskins Commanders play in over 20 stadiums. Big University of Maryland sports fan was at the national championship when they won in 2002. Been to all the bowl games. We'll be going to the bowl game coming up here in Charlotte uh, in December. Uh, my other big hobbies, I love playing poker, so you'll catch me every now and then doing that in the evening. It's kind of a, a, a good mental relaxation for me, mixing my skills of uh, working with numbers and working with people. And so that's kind of what I do as a stress release, but also community service is one of my, I, and I hate to call it a hobby because it's so important, but I, I love spending time working with other people, helping people right here in Frederick County. We're so lucky in Frederick to have so many nonprofits that meet needs. I work with two, which is IJ Hill and I Believe in Me, where we serve at-risk youth in Frederick. I've become friends and gotten to know IJ over the last five years and, and, and seen the great things that he's doing to help make sure people, particularly young people, make the right choices. Another one's love for Lachlan. Bill and Brooke DeSantis became friends over the loss of their son. Uh, and our, our charity nonprofit there gives out free vaccines to folks in the community that don't have health insurance. So what I just love about Frederick County is how people care so much about our county. And that's why I am here, because I really do passionately love and care about Frederick County and I want to continue to serve. And so I want to be a partner with all these organizations that are doing great things here. It's where I was born, it's where I was raised, it's where I'll stay until my last days on the earth. I'm honored to be here and look forward to being a, a very open and accessible county council person. Uh, you'll see me out in the community. Feel free to come up and tell me what your concerns are. Uh, and so I, I just really want to be a representative uh, of the folks of Frederick County and make sure that we're doing things that make Frederick County an even better place to live.